Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a thrift shop with me and a haul. Uh, sorry, you'll have to bear with me. I still sound super congested. I have a sinus infection. Um, I just started antibiotics, but so hopefully it'll be clearing up in the next few days. But I'm at a local thrift store to us and I need to look for baby boy clothes for baby boy number four. And I want to look for some home stuff also, but I'm just sort of going to go through and see what I can find. It is very rainy, um, and I have my two-year-old Samuel with us, so we're going to see how much we can get done today. Baby clothes are definitely top priority, though. So we're going to head in and see what we can find. <music> Okay, guys, we are home. I'm going to show you everything I got. I got almost all baby clothing because that's really what I needed. Um, almost everything in the store today was half off. So I got everything here for $36, which I thought was a really good deal for the amount of baby clothing I got. And it's all in like brand new condition. So I'm going to show you the things that aren't baby clothes first since there's only a few items. I got two books because... Their paperbacks are only a dollar as it is, and then they were half off, so I got both of these for a dollar today. I got The Help, which I have read a bunch of times, actually, but it's one of my favorite books, and I had lent it to somebody and never got it back, So, which is fine. But when I saw it for 50 cents today, I thought I would put it back in my bookshelf. And then I got The Darkest Part of the Forest by Holly Black. I'm reading uh, some other books by her right now, so when I saw... This one, for 50 cents, I was pretty excited about it. And then I got two baskets. Um, this smaller one was only like 62 cents when it was half off. So I got this. And then I got this like medium-sized basket for a dollar. And then that is all I got that isn't baby clothing. So I will show you all the baby clothes I got. Um... We still have some clothes left from our other boys. Um, like I said, this is baby boy number four, but I had just got rid of a lot of it right before we found out we were pregnant, of course. So I went through and sort of made a list of what I needed in each size. Um, so I'm going based on that for what I got today. So we don't need a ton of newborn stuff. Um, my babies don't stay in newborn for very long anyway. But I did see this little lightweight teddy bear jacket, and I thought this would be nice because he's due in early April, and that's sort of like an in-between season in Pennsylvania where it could either still be really cold or it could be starting to get warm, and a lot of the onesies we have for him are short-sleeved. So I got this to be able to put over when he's a newborn, and then I got... A lot of zero to three month because we have, for whatever reason, a lot of three to six month clothing left, but I had almost no zero to three month. So I got this little short sleeved onesie. It just has like little arrow triangles. Um, this long sleeved yellow and gray. This long sleeved green. Which I'm pretty sure I have this one in another size. It might even be in that same size. But I love the just plain green. So I grabbed that. And then I thought this one was so cute. And my older boys love dinosaurs. So I thought that was really fun. And almost all these onesies were 50 cents. Like this little, even the little jacket I showed was, th that was a dollar. So it's like 
brand new. Um, and then I got a couple sleepers because that is pretty much what my babies stay in the whole time when they're super tiny. Um, I got this little alligator one and it has cute little spikies on the side. And this little monkey one with the little monkey butt and monkey feet. Uh, this one is, oh, this one's actually, I didn't even notice this, but this is like a sleeper gown, which is really nice too, because that'll be nice for when it's still a little chilly. I could put like it over a onesie during the day and it'll be easier for diaper changes. Um, and then I got these two little rubbers, this little baseball one, and then cat's batting at the door. This little one. I love putting my little babies in these and I hope towards the end of the zero to three month size it'll be warm enough for him to wear them. And then I got one pair of shorts in that size because like I said sometimes my babies chunk up and sometimes they stay like tiny and like early like, long and skinny but regardless he, it should be warm enough while he's still in zero to three to be able to wear these but they're just these little plain like yellow biker shorts almost and then I got him a few pairs of pants of that size I got these gray ones at the pocket I thought these little blue ones were so cute they're like a waffle knit material another pair of little plain gray and one pair of plain little blue ones so that's all I got in zero to three. And then in three to six, like I said, I do still have a lot that size, but I don't have any shorts. So I got a lot of shorts and a couple of onesies. Um, I got this little tank style onesie because this stuff will all fit him in the summer. And then this one I thought was so cute for like the 4th of July. So I got that. And then everything else is pants of that size. Like I said, I had a lot in that size, so I didn't really need that much. But I saw these little sweatpants with the little stars on the knees, and I thought they would be really cute. And I even thought it would look cute with, like, this onesie if we go out 4th of July night and it's kind of chilly. And then I got a couple pairs of shorts. And these were a dollar each, I believe. So these little plaid ones. These little green stripes, some little denim shorts, so tiny, and just these little blue and gray ones. And then that is it for three to six. And then I got two more things in the um, like six to nine month size, but I want to wait and see uh, like what size he's in. I don't want to buy a bunch of like fall stuff. And have him be a fat baby and be wearing that in the summer. But I did see this little uh, onesie that said, made you smile. And I thought it was so cute. And this little long-sleeved mustache onesie. So, yeah. That is all I got. I think he's going to be pretty well stocked up for the first few months of clothes. And then I got those other few items. And overall, I thought it was a really successful thrifting day. Um. I got pretty much all the stuff that I was looking for, which was mostly baby clothes, but I really needed some baskets too. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching. Please subscribe down below. The next video I'm posting is going to be my Christmas decorate with me. And I will be barely talking in that video. So if I am still <laughs> sick, you won't have to listen to my voice sounding like this. But thank you for bearing with me today. And please hit the subscribe button down below.